Welcome, and on this video we're doing a product review for the Plier Robotics Dinosaur, designed by Caleb Chung. So if you want to learn more about this interactive pet from Prehistoric Times, then please stay tuned. Ah. 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 Hi guys, I'm Philip English from RoboPhil.com. Now on this video we're looking at the Caleb Chung designed Plio Robotic Dinosaur. Plio is an animatronic pet dinosaur toy designed to illuminate the appearance and imagined behaviour of a weak old baby Camsosaurus. It was designed by Caleb Chung, the co-creator of the Furby. Chung's company, Yagobi, first sold Plio and was manufactured by Jetta Company Limited. Chung selected this species of dinosaur because its body shape, stock head and relatively large cranium made it ideal for concealing the sensors and motors needed for lifelike animation. According to Yagobi, each Plio would learn from its experience and environment through a sophisticated artificial intelligence and develop an individual personality. Plio was unveiled on February 7th, 2006 at the DEMO conference in Scottsdale, Arizona and was expected to come onto the Indian American markets around fall 2007. Plio shipment started on December 5th, 2007. Unfortunately though, in April 2009, Yugobi laid off all of his employees and filed for bankruptcy. Luckily though, in June 8th, 2009, Jetta Company Limited, the original Plio manufacturer, announced its relaunch of Plio and continuing the line including accessories such as the vital battery and battery charger components. Since the 14th of July 2009, Plio is owned by Innova Labs Corporations, a division of Jetta. Innova Labs decided to support the Ugobi's Plio owners and continue expanding the Plio's line including new extra accessories. In December 2011, the second generation, the Plio RB, was first launched in America, Europe and Hong Kong, where the Inno Labs headquarters locates. Right, let's have a run through of the features of the Plio. So starting with the camera-based vision system for light detection and navigation, two microphones for binaural hearing, beat detection allows Plio to dance and listen to music, he has 12 touch sensors, so in the head, the chin, the shoulders, the back and the feet, four ground foot sensors, the surface detection, 14 force feedback sensors, that's one per joint, orientation tilt sensor for body position, infrared mouse sensor for objects detecting into the mouth, two-way infrared communication with other plios, infrared detection for external objects. To go into the brains of the plio, he's got a 32-bit Amtel RMZ microprocessor. This is the main processor for plio. 32-bit NXP Semiconductors AMRZ subprocessor, so this is for the camera systems, dedicated audio input processor, and he has four 8-bit processor low-level motor control. In December 2011, the latest iteration, the Plio RB, standing for Reborn, was invented and released. Plio RB is similar to the original Plio, however no two units are exactly alike. Each Plio RB comes with random selected eyeballs, eyelids and eye shadow colours. The skin is always a slightly different hue of green. A special line of pink and blue RBs were released in late 2012. Plio RB has more sensors than the original. The enhancements include 1. Eyes. It can now recognise colours and patterns. It can also detect drop-offs, so it steps back from the risk of falling. 2. It can hear and will turn towards the source. Owners can name and teach it verbal commands using the learning stones. 3. Its nose and mouth. It can sense what kind of food or medicine owners are feeding and then it will choose to eat or not according to its stimulated needs and wants. 4. The skin. It can sense the temperature of its surroundings and react accordingly. It can sense whether it's being patted or hit and react to touch. And 5. The time. It can recognise the time to wake, eat and sleep. There are altogether nine new kinds of food and medicine items made for the Plio RB in different health and life situations, and seven new learning stones. These can teach Plio RB how to bow, to dance, to sign, to walk, towards their owner or play games, etc. Plio RB is designed to behave like a life form, with four distinct life stages. When unboxed, it behaves like a newborn and needs to be hatched and brought up. With proper care, it will grow up into a juvenile after about two days. 
It starts to stand and walk smoothly during its teenage stage and then can be taught to recognise its name. As owners continue to teach verbal commands, it will get to the mature stage and all features will be fully enabled. Thanks guys, I hope you enjoyed the overview of the Plea Robotic Dinosaur designed by Caleb Chung. Now if you like this product review and want to see even more robot reviews then please hit the subscribe button to keep up to date with the latest videos that come out. Please have a look below where I've put links relating to these videos as well as other information about the Plio robot. If you have any questions or want to see a product review of a particular robot then please write me a message in the comment section and I'll see what I can do. Thanks guys and I'll see you next time.